Welcome to Vectorland Series 3.0. Vectorland is a powerful tool for designing, comparing, and analyzing deposit laminates. This video will introduce some of the basic features of the program. Vectorland opens to your home screen, where you can create a new project or access an old one. On the left side of the screen, you will find the contact information for your Vectorply sales representative and a message box where we will post updates about Vectorply and Vectorland. To get started, I'll choose an existing project. The main project page is where we will build and compare our laminates. Along the top row, I can rename my project, share or send a copy of the project to another user, or delete the project entirely. You will also notice the Calculate button, which we will use after reordering or alternating layers in a laminate. On the far right of the top row is a checkbox where you can mark your project private. By default, this is left unchecked to allow our technical services team to help you troubleshoot your project. We take your privacy very seriously and we will never view a project without first getting your permission. Additionally, your account projects are never visible to other users outside of Vectorply. And by checking this box private, you will fully remove our ability to see or access this project. I already have a laminate created, but I wanna build a new one for comparison. To do this, I will click the add laminate button to open up a blank laminate. I can also click the copy laminate to create a copy of the current laminate, which is useful if I'm only making a minor change. Next, I will click the Add New button on the Layers table. This will bring up the searchable database for Vectorland. By default, the material database contains all of Vectorply standard materials, as well as a selection of cores and commodity fibers such as CHOP and stitch mat. We can also add additional custom materials as needed. You can search the database by specific architecture, fiber type, or weight. I prefer to search by name. Vectorland considers the top layer to be the tool side, so our first layer is going to be a CHOP mat skin coat. I will search for CHOP and then choose the three ounce version. Click the material and then click add. Next, I will search for EQXM2608. You'll notice that there are two options, one for open mold and one for infusion. The two versions only differ in fiber content and it is possible to adjust these materials to fit your specific process. I'll choose the open mold version. I wanna add three layers, so I'll click this drop down, select three and then click add. With our laminate added to the layers table, I can drag and reorder layers, adjust fiber content or orientation, and input fiber costs in dollar per pound, or for cores, dollars per square foot. By also inputting a resin cost, Vectorlam can provide a dollar per square foot price for the entire laminate, allowing you to quickly compare the total cost for multiple laminates. Below the input table, the laminate comparison table displays the laminate's physical and mechanical properties. The table can be customized to add, remove, or reorder properties, and can also be printed into an easy to read report. Vectorlam also includes various calculators for engineering analysis. Clicking on the tools and analysis button at the top of the page will open up a new page with the available tools. The beam and plate calculators can be used to analyze for deflection and stress safety factors. For marine users, the DNVGL and ISO 12215 calculators can be used to analyze laminates in accordance with the associated marine design standards. As always, Vectorlam is free to use and our technical services team is available to help you answer any questions or provide additional guidance for Vectorlam or any of our materials.